Hey everybody, Lancer here, welcoming you to a bonus episode of Ted Enigma for the Super Nintendo. Now, it has been several months since I finished this game, but I never did uh, end up getting lits to expand, so I figured I would go ahead and do that. Basically, uh, in order to do that, we have to... There was one little thing I missed out on. Let's get there real quick. Because basically there was just one character I didn't talk to after a certain point. And thanks to uh, one of my viewers, I don't remember their username. I think it had something to do with fire or something, but they kind of pointed it out to me. But yeah, basically after you... You, you have to talk to this fisherman after you uh, give the, t the tin sardines or whatever. Where am I going? I don't know where I'm going. I'm just hanging out. Yeah, this guy. You won't believe this. Ever since I gave you some tin sardines, I've been getting orders upon orders for them. I can't keep up alone. I'm getting my neighbors to help now. That's all you had to do. As stupid as that is, that's all you had to do. Now we just want to head to like a lore and then come back and it should expand. But yeah, that's basically all... That, that, that's it. That, that's all there was to it. That, that That's why it wouldn't expand. I don't... <laughs> it's just one of those things. Do, 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 do. Alright, now it should be expanded. You can only expand it once. And it doesn't change a whole lot, but the town looks a little bigger and, you know, kind of thing. Yeah, see? It was just that one little thing. And, you know, it happens a lot in games, especially older games, where, like, you have to talk to one NPC at a certain time in order to trigger plot progression or something. <laughs> That's one of my pet peeves in games, but, yeah. So, Litz has been expanded. Let's see what's going on. We got a hospital. That's cool. Do you need fever? Me Do you need a fever medicine? No, but I'll take one, I guess. A medicine for fever? Can I have some? Here. If someone is suffering from fever, give them this to drink. Can we get fever medicine? Can't do nothing with it, but... We... we you, you can get another one. There's no reason to have it, but there it is. I'm sorry, there's just one medicine per person. <laughs> right, okay. Dr. Emilio's friend brought a fever cure from the new continent. He's distributing it for free at the reception desk. Alright. Dr. Emilio is a fantastic doctor. He treats the poor like us for free. That's nice. I heard the doctor here was good. So I came all the way from freedom. It's free, too. Dr. Emilio's friend was found. The doctor seems very happy. Well, that's nice. Some of these people may have said the same thing, but I don't really remember what they said before because it was, oh, uh, it it was so long ago that I recorded this game. So I got caught by a chair. Wah wah! It hurts. That's too bad. It's good my daughter became better, but now she fell out of a tree. <laughs> I'm a doctor. I heard about Dr. Emilio and came to help. Compared to Dr. Emilio, I am still inexperienced. Yeah, well, you, you, you got a skeleton over there that you can practice on, so... That's a thing. Okay. Wah, 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 wah. Hey, at least now I can talk to people without having to worry about the joystick moving on its own, ending the conversation when I don't want it to. That's nice. Columbus has become much better. He just went out. I told him to slow down a bit more, but he likes to keep moving. When I spoke of Neo Tokyo, Columbus became agitated and nervous. I hope he doesn't get involved in anything bad again. Yeah, well... He's Columbus. He's an explorer, you know. He's got to keep on moving. Bum, bum. Out of the way, tree. Doo -doo. There's a bridge here, but I think that just leaves town. 
Yeah. So there's there's two ways to leave town now. That's kind of nice, isn't it? I think it's nice. Oh, shit. I'm not controlling this. Controller turned off. Oh, man. This, this makes sense. This is the first time I've recorded in a few weeks, and my controller just happens to die now. That's just perfect. Hold on. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, anyway. So, yeah, you can kind of leave, leave town that way, which is nice. Uh, there's nothing over here. There's something here. What's this? The Quick Booster Coffee is 10 gems. It has a somewhat bitter adult flavor. I don't want some, but... Maybe Ark likes coffee, so... We'll let him have some. Coffee break. Tasty. Yeah, I don't buy that at all. <laughs> Feeling less tired? Not particularly. Um, what do we got going on here? I'm kind. Yeah, yeah, okay. It is a small town that grew with its fisheries and cannery industry. In the future, more affluent lifestyles will be desired. Okay. So, so basically it didn't have much to work with, but... It took what it had and made something of itself, basically. So this is the cannery. You won't believe this. Ever since I gave you some tin sardines... Oh, yeah, I think he says the same thing. Yeah. But now he has a back room with a bunch of stuff. People are helping out. Tin sardines have made Litz very famous. To think we were only a small isolated fishing village. Now look at ya. Tin sardines are packed in cartons and exported. That's nice. Do, 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 do. What are you up to, sir? Hey, don't walk in me. Boy, you, you know the Quatros? They're nomads who live in camps. They sing, they dance, sing, trade with the locals to earn money, I hear. Don't call me boy. I'm not your boy. So there's a church, looks like we got stained glass windows now. That's nice. My sister got better. I have to give my thanks to the Lord. That's good to know. God is compassionate. He always looks upon us the weak. Yeah, I think you said that before. We had lovely stained glass windows put in. This too is a blessing from God. Amen. Actually, it's kind of a blessing from me. I mean, if, if we're being completely honest here. I did give that guy the crystal, you know. Hey. To make better towns, we must educate children as future workers. We established a school under that ideal. So is this like Sunday school? Is that basically what's going on here? This is boring. Why do we have to do this? People in primitive days never had to go to school. Yeah, because they were too busy fighting for their lives. I'm studying history now. There were many important people who made different cultures. Yep. 
Our teacher stories are easy to understand. They're neat, too. Oh, that's good. Swinging a weapon around now is so old. From now on, it's the people with brains who will run the world. What's this kid doing? Shh! Don't tell the teacher I'm skipping out. Oh, so he's hiding in this little storage area thingamajigger? Alright, well. It's exciting stuff. Wee 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 wee. Alright. What else is going on around here? What do you got in here? It's like an extra building that was built. Whoa, crafts. It's like a maze of jars. Oh, Link would be in heaven in this place. He would want to be left alone and he'd have all the fun in the world. But there's a magic rock in here. Which obviously you need to expand lits in order to get that. So that's another one. Not that it really matters at this point, but... Very good of you to come. This, too, is another example of my works. Okay. Hope you don't mind, I'm just gonna destroy your jars, because I kind of have to to get over here. Gotta destroy them all. That's the arc way. What do we got back here? Hmm... I became an apprentice after seeing that stained glass. I want to become an artist who creates work that inspires people. Well, that's good. It's good to be an inspiration. Did you see the stained glass at the church? I made it. I made it using the crystal you gave me. It looks good, right? Yeah, it does. Now, me meanwhile, I'm just going to destroy more jars if it's all the same to you. Alright. So that does it for this place. A good breeze is blowing. It's perfect for sailing, I hear. What's going on here now? Hey, how you doing, man? What's up? I spoke with a man in Columbus. He told me about a small village in Norfest Forest. Yeah, man, it's, it's a nice place, or, or rather it used to be at one time. Now it's, like, kind of empty, but, yeah. Woo, let's break stuff. Looks like we got an item shop. I don't think there's a anything worth getting here, but, you know, the, the, the usual stuff. Standard affair. And as for weapons, I don't think there's anything new here. Silver pike, ice pick, ring mail, silver vest, silver armor, whatever. Nothing we ought need, obviously. Hey, what are you doing, man? You went to the new continent? What is it like? I want to go. We'll go. Get your eye on a ship. Litz's specialties are tin sardines and stained glass. Cool. Hey, talk to me! Hey, freaking antisocial people. Did you see the church windows? It's called stained glass. Oh uh, no. I hope to make it a reality, you know. So here's an inn. Hello, it's ten gems a night. Would you like to stay? Sure. The room is t to the northeast. Rust up good. Nah, I don't really want to. But I suppose I could. Just, just for fun. Uh, no more sardines, please. Oh boy, I think he's had enough of sardines. How you doing? Everything here I'm proud of. Eat plenty. Like, I, I probably mentioned this when I originally re recorded this game, but I'm not a big fan of sardines, but they're not bad in small doses. Let's take a rest, because why not? Sleep! Sleep is nice. So I think that's about all there is now. Unless there's something new going on at the port. I don't know if the port changed at all once uh, Litz expanded. Maybe it did. I, I guess we could check real quick.
It looks like they're kind of connected now. I don't know if they actually are or anything, but... Let's... Anything new going on here? Legend tells of an explorer finding an animal paradise in Africa. He supposedly found a most brilliant and beautiful gem, but he disappeared afterwards in the Sahara Desert. Maybe that treasure was also lost with him. What a waste. So I think that's, I think that's kind of a clue on how to get one of the sunstones, even though that's... <laughs> That's yesterday's news, but yeah. Eh, most of them are gonna say that, it would seem. Okay. So I guess that's kind of a clue, though. Like, if you didn't know where all the sunstones were. But we did, so it didn't really matter. How you doing? Oh god. Do people, like,. Get some individuality, please. Oh, that just... Okay, well, I, I guess that's it, so... Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this little bonus episode. I, I just felt like I had to, to record that. It was kind of bugging me that I never did that, but yeah. So there it is, and yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed this LP, and uh, thanks for watching. Good stuff.